On the salt pans of the Kalahari Desert in southern Africa, the Khoisan people hunt and gather. It's in this region Professor Vanessa Hayes examined the DNA of more than a thousand people. Analyzing just the maternal lineages, she made a remarkable discovery. Pinpointing our anatomically modern human homeland. And where we found this homeland was south of the Zambezi River in what is today largely the northern part of Botswana. Has the samples arrived? Some scientists argue East Africa was humanity's first home. Others dispute the idea of a single origin. Professor Hayes used genetics, linguistics, geology and climatology. The whole of southern Africa was in a mega drought, yet the founder population was living in a wetland, like an oasis in a desert. As the climate changed, green corridors opened up, encouraging migration across the continent. Those pathways matched population movements seen in DNA today. But what we also see, which is absolutely amazing, is that another group actually stay in the homeland and can still be found there today. The study won't convince all scientists, but Fran Dory says it's exciting work. These are our ancestors. Um, this is our species. Um, yeah, I think the, the really interesting bit is that, you know, we are very closely related. To understand being healthy and how disease and health are linked, we really need to understand who we are and where we come from, because our past dictates our future. A past slowly coming into focus. Michael Slezak, ABC News.